Hello, so I am in Burger King with Will Hello. and Brian. Hi. Brian's wearing his crown. I'm king. The king of all burgers. Oh, king. The king of burgers. Oh, bitches. <laughs> and I have ordered um, <laughs> mozzarella sticks that are like rock hard <laughs> and they're not very nice. And then I also got cheesy, spicy cheesy ball things. But they are good, but those mozzarella sticks like rock hard. And like Brian had a really skanky burger, and he took it up. And we're like, oh, we can't give you another one, you have to pay for another one. I know, how rude. Okay, I don't know what's happened to us. We have now ended up in like Oz. Here's my little munchkins. That's the mayor of the munchkin city. <laughs> yeah, they're my friends. But this did remind me of the yellow brick road, kind of. Sort of, though it's not exactly yellow as much. Just stone. Just stony. Just, oh yeah, do you like my, do you like my crown? Yep. No, I don't. Just put one. Oh, I've got one. Just sit so on the my... king and queen of that castle. Yeah, me and Bree Bree. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to call you that in my vlog. <laughs> me and Brian are the king and queen of this castle over there. Right there. I'm just a slave. He's the jester. driver that's slave. Mm. Victim of slavery. Oh, he is a victim of slavery. Okay. Water. Okay, so, welcome to the Holy Ghost Cemetery. Sponsored by National Lottery. <laughs> this was a beautiful map. Oh, and sponsored by National Lottery. This, this was town's burial ground for 600 years, blah, and blah, blah, blah. that is where we're going. When I was doing some research on this place on the internet, someone wrote in a forum that the founder of Burberry is buried here, like the person that invented the um, Burberry. And well, I have come across this massive tombstone that says Burberry, so it might be true. Brian walk around in his crown. Did you do any research on this place? I looked a little bit. Oh. But this, I think I figured out where we saw them with like smaller ones. Mm. I think it's the footstone like, which you really put them. Yeah. That's Elizabeth Franklin on there it says the yeah. Oh, wow this is a big one. Oh so many snowdrops it's so pretty. So one of the scarier things when you're in a graveyard is when you kind of like see holes everywhere. It's where the zombies have risen. It looks like one, these very old graves it's like has like zombies risen from the dead okay so if i did my research correctly there was a woman called mrs blunden and years and years ago i can't remember the exact date she was ill and accidentally drank poppy water which put her into a coma and back then they didn't know this and they thought she was dead so then they buried her then um, some children were playing and they heard a lot of noise, like a lot of scratching coming from like the grounds. So they dug her up and I think she, it said that she had bit all her lip off because obviously she'd been buried alive and they dug her up and then realised she'd died and then they buried her again and then it happened again and then there was like more scratches on her and I think it was the second time she finally did die. Now I also read that she was buried in some trees <laughs> where, well there's like loads of trees around as you can see like trees everywhere <coughs> excuse me so she was buried in like some trees and apparently the ghost of her is supposed to turn up and give you a tour around the area um so we've been trying to find her grave if it exists i don't know i mean it's a very long time ago it might not exist anymore but we found this one which says james blunden on it and then there's a little one and obviously it's all like broken and then this one here, which says James Blunden, and then of course all the writing has disappeared. So we don't know if it's like this bit or not. I think it's over there, because I don't know, I just think it's over there. Okay, Will has a feeling it's if over there. If you look there. between the trees, there's something in between the trees and it looks like a, something behind the tree. Oh, that tree. is a man. Is it? Yeah. I don't know. Okay, so that's a man. Okay. It might be a woman, you never know. 
It might be a woman. All right, well, we're gonna carry on and continue to find Mrs. Blunden. Check this out. I don't know if it's gonna pick up well, but this whole pathway here, which goes all the way down and then like all the way around, it is actually made out of tombstones, you know, like the headstones on the graves. Um, the weather's probably like made most of the writing go away. But like, as you can see, there's like writing and everything. And um, it kind of freaks me out a bit, just like all these like tombstones. Are you okay in there? No. Oh my god, are you trapped inside the castle? Yeah. Oh no. I know. What should we do? Something. Don't worry, King Sammy to King? Queen Sammy <laughs> to the rescue. <laughs> oh Will. Hello. Will, you need to go and save Brian. He saved me. He saved himself. Oh okay, he saved himself. <laughs> You're your own hero these days. <laughs> this hole has epic memories from the other night. Oh yeah, right, let me put my camera down. Right. Okay, that's not actually going to stand there. Sand. Right, so we came here the other night when it was pitch black and um, I decided to look through this hole and I was like looking in there like, oh, it looks scary. <laughs> and then Will came around the other side and he was like, boo! And I literally went backwards and fell over and got muddy and landed on my ass. It was um, great. It was, yeah, great. In here, this bit here, which looks quite scary, there's actually some tombstones in here. Now, my camera's like quite dark, but it looks quite scary. So it's behind all like this. And then, um, so we go around, it's all got like these tombstones in. Du, du, du. And then it goes like up there. And then it's like the hole in the roof kind of bit. So yeah, pretty spooky stuff. Oh, sorry, Brian. I didn't mean you to mean for you to bring all my stuff. Everything. Sorry, I left my stuff for Brian. He knows his shit. He brought it to I me. He knows He's his stuff. That is the queen. Okay, so when I was like playing in the dark the other night, and I was looking obviously up the path full of gravestones, I came across this one. Which freaked me out because it's like a skull, like skull and crossbow sort of thing. And you can't read what it says. Oh, I think it does say Jolly. Jolly something or other. Hi, vlog buddy. Uh, hashtag vlog buddy. <laughs> hashtag vlog buddy. But yeah, so it's got a skull and then it says Jolly. So maybe it says something like the Jolly Roger. I don't know. Maybe there's a pirate built there. Who knows? Go on, Will. Let's see this. He is going to jump from there. Oh. Go back again. Come on, boy. I think, I think you should do it. Oh. I can't do it. I'm only five foot two. I've got short legs. Oh, you just jump higher. I'm okay, but I will probably die. Yeah. So, um, what is it? Um, go ahead and jump. Do, do, I'm going to make it. I'm going to like really Jump. Do, Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Just go ahead and jump. <laughs> I will do it in a minute. Three, two, one. I don't want to hurt myself. It'll be fine. Do it. <laughs> Rubbish. Do, do, do. Oh. oh. Well, he did it. I should be able to do it, really. Have another go. Maybe I'll do it like this. Go on then. No. <laughs> <laughs> if I did that, I would definitely fall off and hurt myself. Anyway, the building. So, <laughs> if we go over here, this could have been like, I don't know. So you got that and this and maybe there used to be like a bridge bit. But then were all these here when it was built? I don't know. They're weird, like graves like, was it, everywhere. Was it a castle or? I think it was like a sort of, sort of church place. But were these two separate buildings or were they? No, they were joined. Because oh. I looked it up on the interwebs. Oh. That one there looks like. <laughs> it's like a cow or something. It looks like. Let's go have a look. Let's go have a look. It looked like. From where I was, it looked like a body. Maybe not. 
I don't know. I thought it looked like a body. I thought that. When I got closer, it did not look like a body. This all kind of does. It's like face down. It has no arms. True. True. We are going up. No! We're going to die! Oh, no! I oh. oh, don't tempt fight. Oh. Oh, so there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so right, basically they're taking the piss out of me. Because... Oh, I thought we were going to die. <laughs> basically, the other night we came here and Brian started vlogging on his thing, on his thing, <laughs> on, on, his, on his phone, and um, the lift made a really scary noise and I shit myself and I was like, we're going to die. And he caught it on video, basically, oh, and put it on brain. Facebook. Now we've got to find the car. Oh, I know where we're going. I know exactly where we're going. Are you sure? I think it's this way. He thinks. He knows exactly where he's going, but he thinks it's this way. That's very um, positive. Oh. Have we found the car? That way. Okay. Okay, so thanks to these two, well, Will, we have literally just walked around in um, a huge circle because he knows where he's going, doesn't he? He knows where he's going. And we still haven't found a car. We're lost in a car park. You better just go to the place where we were. I think you're right. Let's go this way. This is, this is you know, Will, because he definitely knows where he is. I know where we're going. Okay, Brian knows where we're going. Going to where we're going.